that's what it looks like now that I did the lines, but it's still messed up. But it says uh, freedom in Arabic. And then there's, I was, I was gonna take this smashed phone, I was gonna put it right there, but I don't know. I feel like I messed up this canvas and um, there's nothing I can do about it. So, I was gonna tell Lizzie, um, I have screwed up so much. And um, I feel one way at one time and then another time I feel different. And at one time I was just so into Miley that it was just like tunnel vision. And then Lizzie was kind of attached to her. And now, uh, even though all I'm seeing is Miley, uh, all I'm thinking about is Lizzie because um, cause she's who I want to be around right now, which I want to be around Miley too, but um, she's who I'm, who, I don't know, she just, she's who I'm thinking about. And um, a long time ago I said they told me to tell her that I loved her and um, yeah, that's that's true, and that's because I was scared. And I, I, also, the reason they told me they had, they had to tell me to do it is because I was embarrassed, um, and I just didn't want to say it. And also, it, it, and I, I just never really believed it. Um, and no one has to tell me to tell her that I love her now. Um, if there's anything I know is that I love her, and yeah, I might get embarrassed. I, I might I might make a fool out of myself someday when I find out that I'm crazy and I don't even know her. But. Um, it doesn't change that I love her. So I've been watching this TV show on my block and um, it's, I don't think they like white people very much, um, but it's probably because they have some experience with a place like South Central Los Angeles, which is gang wars and um, like their world is brutal and then it's like, they, they blame us for it. And, um, you know, I spend my life meeting Spooky and my life, like Spooky's a character that's like this shaved head Mexican guy with a teardrop. And I, I, at least at certain times in my life, I've spent a lot of time around Spooky and his friends. And um, I guess I don't fully, uh, I've never, it's hard to fully appreciate how bad things can be in certain areas. and. But, but also, I, th I think the reason I'm mentioning that I spend my life around Spooky is because my life's scary. And um, I'm, I think I'm more scared now than during times in my life where I've, I've been hanging out with guys like Spooky all the time. And so I feel like a lot of us are scared. Um, so I'm guessing Lizzie's scared. But I really think it's going to be okay. We just all have to... Be super careful. You know, I'm, 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 we have to be so careful. I'm sorry about the way I've acted. I'm sorry that I'm the way I am, which you tell me something hard, hard enough, I am going to repeat it. And I'm going to uh, just like, I can't help it. Sometimes I get so, they, they make me so angry about things a person's done that it makes me want to say something and I can't help it. And um, does that make make me a bad candidate for president? The only reason I I would I care about being a bad candidate for president is because um, I want Lizzie to want me, and I know that sometimes my behavior um, makes it so you don't want me, and that's why I want to I want to behave better. Um, that's what also why I'm just so sorry about the way I've acted in the past. It's going to be all right. We're going to get through this. It's just, it's going to be a long process.